What's up, what's up, what's up? <clears throat> Got a casty cast for you guys. <clears throat> uh, just gonna say right now, if you guys like the channel, like the content, give it a like, give it a subscribe, and um, my goal is to get a, a thousand subscribers. That'd be awesome. And um, yeah, so I mean, I'm gonna be posting this one on Friday, and we got Lee Boak Gu, however you say it. I can never say his name, but it's also Gold SCV, and he is on the Terran. So I got two games of Gold SCV against Brain, and um, <clears throat> hope you guys have a good Friday, and uh, hope you guys have a good weekend as well. And one more thing, if you got any good two versus two games, send send them my way. I always like the two versus twos. I'm getting better at casting them. They're a little bit tough to cast, but we'll get right into it. Let's go. So we got Liba Goo, extra command center early on against none other than the Brain Ski. And looks like he's going to go with a double hatchery, no choke, and going to get the gas before the pool here. So... Interesting strategy. So I got, yeah, I got a, a ZVT, Brain Z versus Gold SCVT. And we know Gold SCV's Terran versus Zerg is sick. And then I got a TVP, Brain, on the Terran, Gold SCV on the Protoss. And we know Gold SCV's Protoss is sick. So I'm pretty sure this is Gold SCV. There is a little exclamation mark there, but. Oh, I think it is him, so. Anyways, it's still brain, so. We all like to see the brain ski. So there's your pool. Getting that gas. Gonna maybe wait till he gets 100. And we'll see if his timing is almost perfect. Maybe he's gonna get a lair first, we'll see. Late scout cup coming in. And not gonna really scout with his overlords. He's just gonna see if any... SCVs or Ryans are coming so he knows to make a sunken colony. I think that's what his plan is. So let's see if he's gonna get he's gonna get speed and the lair at the same time. At the same damn time right there. So here's your SCV gonna get that scout action coming. And there's another there's a Ryan gonna go get that scout. Uh, sometimes the music's loud, sometimes it's not, so uh, uh, uh. here comes the two Zergling's going to try to take this out, micro it a couple times, just so Gold SCV does not get any information of what he's up against. And he's going to try to sneak it in here. So this is going to be on point and going to just die cut right there. A couple more Zerglings coming. Going to try to block it. This is why I love the Brain Ski. He's always... Hiding or finding out information not letting you get the information and he's He's either Getting the information or not letting you get the information. So he's gonna try to get this. It's getting closer and closer So I see if he's like, oh, I need some more power But here are your Rhinies so And now he has speed done. So we'll see if he maybe goes he's got a hatchery he's going with a spire and Two more gas on the way. So, and here is your factory. And stim on the way. I'm sure three medics are on the way. Yep. So, in this situation, sometimes you want to just play defensive. If you're up against a non-choke Zerg. And sometimes the Zerg will just send out a drone and make a hatchery. Because they realize... Uh, it's gonna be beneficial for them in the long run so if they can get that hatchery out but looks like we might see an attack from gold SCV here and gonna take out some of these guys right here gonna pull those back right away stim action coming and let's see if I'm gonna try to take them out and he's trying to sneak them in to get some information so just really toy in a little bit and he's gonna leave these guys here and they'll probably be able to take out these Zerglings. 
Here's your fire bat. So Michael with a fire bat drop. So I'm gonna stim these guys. The fire bat's gonna do absolutely tons of damage. Here comes your scout though, and this is what Brain does. Does have a gold SCV. Does have a scan. Might might try to take out an SCV if he can. But here comes the attack from gold SCV. He has a science facility on the way. And let's see, our Muta's queued up. 13 Muta's, just 8 finished right here. So, gonna go right on the attack. And I think Gold SCV did see those Muta's so. though. He's got even more queued up. So, we'll see if he starts building. Gonna pull back his Rhinies and start building some turrets here. So, super, super quick Muta's and a lot of them. So, we'll see the Muta Micro. Gonna take this guy out, I'm sure. Wrong place, wrong time, and gonna take all these guys out. So try or try to taking out those SCVs that were building the turrets, but nice job there, sending the uh, sending more SCVs over there to finish those up. So not gonna get much done with that. It was a nice attempt, and now I'm gonna start pushing pushing the brain ski here. So uh, brain gonna put ten. He's got only ten muta. So uh, Gold SCV playing this one really, really nicely. He's got a turret here. Smart move there. Gonna try to probably take out this tank if he can. These Sunkins are helping out, but... Uh, Gold SCV's turn is really, really good. Take out that SCV, so good job there, but... Uh, I do think this one's in favor of... Gold SCV right now. And 12 Mutas, so they should be able to take out... These guys, here comes the Zerglings. Use the Zerglings with the Mutas. And gonna leave that tank wide open, so the tank is gonna go down. So, and the turret. So we'll see what Brain does here. He's gotta be offensive, because he just doesn't have that big of a base. So we're gonna try to hunt these guys down. And nice stim action there by Gold SCV. Gonna make Brain have to pull all the Mutas over here. And this is a lot of Mutas, so. Say about 12, maybe 14. And a couple more mutas over here with some scorgies. Gonna probably try to take out the vessel if he can. And I think irradiate is done. Nice little micro on the hill action. And gonna try to take it. Here comes the scorgies. Here comes some more zerglings. I'm gonna try to break in here with the mutas. Ooh, is he gonna get it? Not gonna be able to get it. It was close. I think he needed more zerglings there. And that's what happens when you go with an extra command center like Gold SCV did. And he's probably going to get... He's got Valkyries, and that's huge against Mutas. You always want to get Valkyries. So, Hive on the way. Another Hatchery on the way. And... Yeah, Gold SCV just building up his base. And we've seen Gold SCV can... Uh, he can beat Brain. He's beaten Brain, Protoss Prot versus Protoss. We've seen him beat him Brain a lot of times, so uh, I would not be surprised if Gold SCV wins this, and even if he wins the next game. Um, so here comes the attack. Gonna try to cut off some units and maybe try to attack the base. And he's gonna use the Mutas to try to micro and take these out and use these Zerglings in here to take out. Gold SCV's base here, so I like that move. Smart move there, but he needs to try to survive this attack. And he's got the Mutas here, trying to take out the Valkyrie. He's gonna get the Valkyrie, I think it's so close. Gonna take out this tank for sure, nice job there. The Valkyrie doing some work, and these Zerglings are doing some work, but they're gonna get taken out by the Rhinies. A couple more Mutas here, about eight of them. And getting closer and closer, not gonna have that Greater Spire. And that Valkyrie saved the day. Gonna try to micro. Yeah, that Valkyrie just saving the day right there. And yeah, I think this one's gonna be over real soon. Any upgrades yet? No upgrades just yet. There's two more Valkyries here, so they're gonna finish off these Mutas for sure. That splash damage. And gonna move this tank in and probably go after the. Drones if he can and nice little placement there a couple more Valkyries here and taking out the drones so 
That is going to be the GG for sure. Using the drone to try to attack. But, yeah, this one's going to be over. Really, really nicely played by GoldSCV showing you why he is a boss player. Now, I would like to see more ZVTs of these two. So, yeah, just going to leave there. So, first game goes to GoldSCV there. <clears throat> it goes this one. So, we got another Protoss. I mean, we got a Protoss versus Terran. And... <clears throat> we'll see how this one plays out and Brain gonna have a corner spot and he is on the Terran and he's got an amazing Terran and Gold SCV has an amazing Protoss so not gonna go with an extra command center not gonna play risky at all gonna go with an extra Nexus for Gold SCV uh, building is Eric's a little out of place there all three of them so there might be a reason, there may not be a reason. I don't know why, but it is kind of ugly. Yeah, I think he was thought he was maybe going to be up against a middle build. So triple barracks for Brainski, and looks like he might just go with another command center. He's getting the minerals for it. So going to run home his Rhines. Make sure he can take out this probe. Does not want his opponent to get any information. And here is your SCV. Gonna pull it back and save it. Beautiful job. Maybe he's gonna build a barracks down here. We'll see. Here's your command. I'm gonna lift this up and make it look better. I think he might have did that just in case he was gonna be up against a middle build. And he can run around his barracks. So I think that's why he did that. And gonna go quickly into that triple. And let's see what Gold SCV is going with. He's got the Cyber. Going to get the Pylon on the side. Does not want to lose any of his probes to something stupid like Firebats. Getting a Barracks lifted over and Firebats taking out your probes. And he's going to go with Dragoons. We're going to see some Dragoon action. And that's going to be a good counter against a early... An early triple. And putting the Rhines here so... Might try to make it look like he's gonna go for the brain. Might try to make it look make make it look like he's gonna go for that frontal attack, and he's even putting some rinds around for drops, and this is gonna put him make him very very vulnerable. So, and there's your first dragoon. Range is not done yet. Let's see if he's got three more dragoons on the way. Yeah, and. Yeah, so sometimes you'll take your rinds and you'll put them really close to the choke and make the opponent think you're going to go with an attack and then make your opponent have to build some more cannons. So putting these guys all at these corners, maybe he's worried about some type of robotics, some sneaky, sneaky, sneaky drop of some sort. Uh, maybe like an expo robotics or some sort. And here is... The robotics though, and we'll see the comp sets not getting made just yet. So and there's your first factory, and here are four dragoons. And I am excited for this one, guys. I am excited for this one. Other robotics on the way, I think. So he's probably gonna go with some type type of reaver. No comp sets yet, so playing it a little bit risky. And here comes your dragoons. We'll see how quickly. He notices this. I try to take out that Dragoon right there, but gonna have to pull back the Rhinies. And gonna run up. And here comes, gonna try to wait for his other Rhines here. And he should be okay with these Rhines though. Gonna probably take out this, try to take out that Dragoon. Gonna have to micro this guy back. Not doing any micro action, so there's your micro action. And a Zealot and a Dragoon here. And no Stim. Maybe he does have stim. It looks like he's getting range. Going to build a bunker. Trying to get a couple medics to help out. And going to almost take out that Dragoon. Nice little micro. 
Almost gonna take out this Dragoon, that guy Michael up. Beautiful Micro from Gold SCV here. And gonna get that bunker. Nothing to repair it though. A lot of these Dragoons are pretty low HP. So, and with the medics helping out, he might be okay. Gonna have to Micro backwards, gonna pull some SCVs to help out. And I think he's gonna be okay. So good job there by Brain. I'm gonna build maybe three bunkers. Yeah, gonna build three bunkers here. And the micro action right here by Gold SCV. Might take out a, uh, an SCV with the Dragoon. And doing a little more and more micro action. He's got another robotics. And going with another robotics. So he's gonna have four robotics. Gonna go with a lot of drops here. Three more Dragoons on the way. Here's your tank. Siege is almost done, so he is safe now. And he's getting his comp sets now, getting an upgrade on his uh, Rhines. And there's your Siege. <clears throat> so maybe he's going to put these guys on the hill. We'll see. Oh, there's your Reaver. So he's going to go right into a Reaver drop. And this is at 6 minutes and 25 seconds. Let's see if the scans come down from Brain. He will probably scan right here and probably right here. Waiting for it. We get three more barracks here. And gonna go, go with the frontal attack. Maybe to just do a little distraction action. I like how that rhymes. And that drop's gotta be coming in anytime soon. Doesn't have vision over here, just has one turret. No defense. There's your armory, double armory coming. So now he's going to start leaving these guys and not using his scans at all. Maybe he's worried about some type of DT drop. Here's your drop coming in. Going to sneak in here. And going to drop one of the Reavers down here. Take out an SCV. Going to run around. And leave. So he had an opportunity right there. Let's get back to the... He's going to put these guys on the hill. Take out these turrets. So smart move there by... Gold SCV, he just keeps getting better and better. I mean, he's a stud. This is why I think that if Hydra played Brain, and even Gohan, they could take a couple games games off of Brain. A couple tanks right here. So he is able to see. There's a scan. And we'll see if a big, possible big drop comes and we'll see if brain scans this drop so he does he has one scan left there he's got so he's got a total of three scans just got his upgrade finished on his weapons getting it or on his uh marines there and yeah waiting for this scan i'm surprised he hasn't scanned this slowly building up turrets on the side he's got the tanks here the tank here Seized up. Little turret action here. Waiting for those scans, but they're not coming down. Massive, massive drop here. And we've seen uh, Gangnam Life do this type of drop. A huge drop, but it was against a Zerg. And here's your scans, though. I'm going to see it. And two star ports over here. We get that upgrade. That second upgrade. And so, I'm going to build a couple bunkers. Gonna build one bunker here, one bunker here. Might even build some bunkers down here. Yeah. Smart move there by Brain. And here's where's that dropity drop at? He's just waiting for it to be a monster drop. He's got more Reavers on the way. And he's getting an upgrade for Michael right into some type of carriers. So we'll see. Picking up a couple more Reavers here. And we'll see if he uses disruption web. I think that's, that could be the upgrade for it. I'm not completely sure. Here comes that droppity drop here. And another command summer coming down for Brain. Little supply stuck, but he's spending his money really, really nicely. He's got a couple more depots getting made. And this drop's going to try to sneak in down here. And going to go right into the bunker there. And going to pull the SCVs. And gonna drop all these Reavers right here. Gonna get some work done, but not kill too many of the SCVs. So, 
Good job there by Brain surviving this. I like the placement of the bunkers here. This bunker saved the day. Gonna repair it like a boss that he is. And gonna get carriers right away. So gonna go right into carriers here. Three carriers. And interesting, interesting. And maybe Brain might just go on the offensive right away. We'll see a couple scans coming down. Gonna see he is gonna be up against carriers. Super fast carriers, so. And here comes your cannons in the middle to buy time. And we'll see if Brain builds a bunch more starports. He's getting a uh, covert ops, so he can probably get locked down. Uh, we'll see, and then build some ghosts, so. Here is another factory. Playing off of only one factory this game, so get all these cannons from the Gold SCV Meister. Another big drop getting put together, and, <coughs> and one thing you do with uh, carriers. It <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> is uh, yeah. So this is what I think he's gonna do: use the carriers, distract the turrets, and then. Drop the Reavers either here or drop them here. And looks like Brain is going to go right on the offensive here. So, going to scan here. Not going to see a drop. So, going to maybe expect somewhat of a drop soon. Going to siege up here. No speed for the, the Zullies here. But here is, where's that drop at? Right here. So, the carriers are getting done. He's got two of them. Gonna slowly push out here. He's got an upgrade on his attack. He's got one one on his Rhinies, and getting uh, not getting locked down just yet. So there's your ghost though. Maybe that is locked down. I thought it was a different, a different one, but pushing out here pretty nicely, and gonna stim and take these guys out. They're all unpowered. Gonna move these guys over to the side. Gonna get some cannons on the side as well. A lot of scans coming down. Gonna see the carriers. Gonna see the shuttles. And is he getting getting a vessel? So we got the carriers. We got the reavers here. Gonna pick them up. So good job there by Gold be Taking out a lot of the Rhinies here. And let's see if there's got to be an observer of some. Yeah, observers around the way because he knows that Brain. Might try to lock down the observers or snipe them out with Valkyries or Wraiths if he can. But six ghosts right here, so we might see some lockdown action from Brain here. So trying to push out here, and he's gonna try to take this over. But here's your here's your carriers, and gonna move these ghosts, I'm sure. And here comes the drop right here. Dropping all the Reavers. And these bunkers are really helping out, though. And gonna have to pull back because he is getting attacked. Brain doing a nice job. Slowly working his way in over here. And now he's got. Gonna have 1 1 upgrades, I'm sure. Taking out that bunker. And. Brain looking somewhat healthy. Let's see if there's any upgrades on these. Carriers yet. Can't see, can't see. Little stim action, gonna pull out of there. And. Yeah, both players are playing this one pretty, pretty nicely. The one thing is, I don't usually like carriers against a Terran, a really good Terran player, because they know how to handle carriers pretty well. And more vessels on the way. Upgrades are probably pretty close. There's your lockdown. A couple more scans coming down. Can see the carriers are not there. A couple reavers here, so I'm gonna try to take out these cannons over here. And here comes the attack from Gold SCV. The slow observers. I think he's waiting for that lockdown to finish, and it is done. So he's probably gonna pull these, pull these uh, 
these ghosts over here. So, taking out these turrets one by one. A little micro action. Does have the observers in case there are any rates. And more scans coming down. Maybe going to see an opportunity for maybe a drop of some sort. I'm not sure. Building a command center right here. And going to slowly try to work in here with the carriers. A lot of ghosty ghosts here though. And a couple goliaths coming out. And those upgrades got to be done. So two upgrades on the attack. Nice little EMP. I'm guessing that there's going to be... Yeah, this reaver drop is going to be coming pretty soon, maybe. Holding off on it. He might have been able to get it in there, though. It could have blasted a lot of these ghosts. And Brain is really picking up his his base here. Going to try to take out this engineering bay that's floating. And going to go back over here with the drop. And are these loaded up as well? Some Templars in here. So might go with a Templar drop. And some ghosts down here. We'll see. Maybe a, a nuke will get made from. Maybe a nuke will get made. But here comes the attack. And then maybe take out the vessel. Takes out the vessel. And the lockdown is coming. And it looks like Brain might go on the offensive and attack. And here comes the Reaver drop sneaking in here. Going to drop all these Reavers. And slowly take out a lot of these depots. So I think that's what he wanted to do here. And he could have even gotten him a little bit closer. Taking all this out. Here's another. Going to get rid of these shuttles. So these Reavers going to get locked down though. Beautiful job there by, by Brain. But he's down to 162 max supply right now. So going to have to build a bunch more. Is this a nuke? Yeah. You have to build a bunch more depots. And we'll see if these get locked down. All these ghosty ghosts. Yeah, and these guys. Carriers are going to un. Uh, lockdown right there, or whatever you call it. A couple more scans coming down from the brain ski. And going to rebuild his depots here. Here comes another drop. I think he saw it, though. He's going to see it. And he's going to try to lock down. Nice. Lockdown. He got one of them. Trying to get the other. And it's coming into the. Gonna get the storm off and kill about 14, maybe 20 or so of the SCV. So, good job there by Gold SCV. Gonna get rid of some of his probodobes, realizing he doesn't need them. But the only thing is, he doesn't have any map control. So, let's see what his upgrades are. He's got plus two on his interceptors and sending these guys over. I don't see any. And the observers are going to spot all this out over here. So, going to see these guys move. And then he's going to just slide in over here. Going to see the opening down here. So, nice job there with the observers. And Brain has 2 1 upgrades and a nuke on the way. I think he could possibly maybe nuke over here. Or he's going to maybe nuke down here. We'll see. But here comes your carriers. And it's about 10. Sending all these guys to the middle. This is a lot of cannons and a huge drop coming. I think this is going to have some reavers in it. Three. Oh, all storms up in here. So huge storm drop. We'll see if the lockdowns are on point here. Not seeing any lockdowns. Here comes the droppity drop. Going to get one lockdown on the shuttle. But this one's going to get through. Going to pull the... SCVs, there's your one storm coming down. I'm gonna have a lot of storms that are gonna come through though. And there's another storm. And gonna slowly try to work the front and he's gonna nuke this. Sick move right there. I like it. This is gonna be sick. I do think there might be another storm, but we can't miss the nukey duke. Here it comes. See if the scan happens. Doesn't need it. Blast. <laughs> Blast. Loving it. And let's see if there's a drop. Is there anything in here? Nope. So now it's just a matter of look at using all of the ghosty ghosts to lock down right here. 
And that was a sick nuke. He's got some units over here he can use. Uh, this might have... Nope, it doesn't have anything in it. But he's going to take it out. He does see it. So, playing this one like an absolute bossy boss. And... A few more carriers on the way, though. And Brain has a lot of minerals and gas, so he doesn't really have to worry about his uh, minerals too much. Another nuke on the way. And he has so many ghosts that it just it doesn't really matter. going to EMP these guys, I'm sure. Got them all. And going to do a little defensive matrix and probably start pushing in here. Two, three upgrades. Has a couple SCVs chilling over here, not realizing it. Going to build some more turrets over here. And some more Goliaths coming out. And that nuke is done, so... We'll see if he tries to nuke. He might just lock down a bunch of these and then nuke them. I could see that happening. So, there's another lockdown. And these carriers are coming in. Gold SCV can get rid of even more of his SCVs here. And that guy still has a defensive matrix on him. So, this is kind of open. There's a lot of ghosty ghosts over here. So, drop and drop right here too. I'm going to take out that Templar, take out this Carrier, and Gold SCV is maxed out though. So both players are basically maxed out. It's a matter of units. Going to probably try and get this in and try to get that drop off. If you can get that drop off, Brain is pretty low on money now. So Brain is maxed out. And here comes the attack. Trying to annoy these turrets and try to sneak this in. I don't see... We'll see if it gets locked down. This is his only chance. This guy might get it. There's a couple ghosts down here. Here comes the drop. Let's see if it gets locked down. Is it this guy? Is this guy going to get it? Not going to see it. Oh, he got it just in time. Beautiful job there by Brain. And I'm guessing another nuke's going to come right here. It's going to be this guy. I'm calling it this guy. Nice little storm, though. Maybe he'll do it on the hill or something like that. But he does have a nuke. And... Taking out a lot of these carriers. And some more lockdown coming. Let's see what's in this. Does he have reavers? A lot of reavers in here. He can maybe drop those reavers in here. Help out. There's your nuke coming. And it's this guy, I think. And he's going to get the carriers... Oh, is he going to get him? Oh, he got him. He got him just in time before the nuke could finish. Don't we love nukes? But Gold SCV getting smaller and smaller. And he's going to he start building some zealots to help out his carriers. Might just try to drop on these tanks with all these reavers in here. I think he's got a ton of reavers in here. Going to try to do that right now, but we'll see if they get locked down these shuttles. Gonna even lock. Gee, oh my goodness, that was beautiful. I don't know how he locked those down so fast. Absolutely. Gasu, Gosu, you name it. That was absolutely beautiful. Wow, that was sick. And no speed on the Zellies. Dang, that was so sick. Observers right here going to get blasted. More units coming in. Gold SCV only at 150. Supply and not looking good for gold SCV. And there's still even some units just chilling over here that Brain never even used. Some carriers on the way. And I don't know if the carriers are the best option right here. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be the GG, I'm sure. Wow, that was absolutely insane. That was so sick. And Brain showing you why he is the best at fastest. TVP playing it like a boss. Lockdown machine using the nuke. Absolutely sick. Hope you guys liked it. Give it a like. Give it a subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Peace.